It's been a shocking day for many members of this Hindu temple in Newark, including Chintam Pandya. Whatever happened yesterday, uh, last night, was like a clear act of vandalism. Uh, and uh, it, uh, it was like a vandalism and violence against the Indian community. They were surprised this morning when they found this graffiti. He says this is concerning because it's the first time they've seen something like this since the SMVS temple opened its doors almost two years ago. Which is like uh, not uh, really safe for the community and uh, uh, and the entire like New York City here, right? So uh, <clears throat> such incidents uh, have been happened in other temples also and other places as well. It's another international conflict that hits home here in the Bay Area, says Mihir Mehani co-founder of the Hindu American Foundation. People who put those symbols and names up, they, what, they're push, what they're promoting is a separate state of Palestine. It, it's a, uh, it, it is, is what uh, uh, people who call themselves Khalistanis want as a separate puritanical religious state. So if those people who did this want that, that's something that I think most Americans uh, most Indians, um, you know, most Hindus don't want. He says the Indian American community in the Bay Area is growing and those political issues are now becoming a part of the division here. We mentioned to the Indian consulate was attacked and set on fire in San Francisco earlier this year. Mm -hmm. FBI is investigating as hate crimes and CIA and others. Um, there have been attacks on the consulates in UK, uh, United Kingdom, in London and in Toronto. There have been multiple temples attacked in the United States with similar uh, graffiti, which makes all of us think that this is all connected. This graffiti incident hasn't been classified as a hate crime yet, but Newark police officers are investigating. We're certainly disappointed that this happened. So uh, we're here today just to let you know that we stand in solidarity with you guys. Uh, we're doing everything we can from the city side to help uh, resolve this and see if we can't get to the bottom who did this. But for now, Shintan tells me they will continue coming here to pray and to show support to each other. And that's Jose Martinez reporting. And Jose also says that temple leaders will be having a special meeting on Saturday as well to discuss it.